Hi everyone, I'm Rosie for Leaky News and we were sent a preview copy of the Harry Potter Wizards collection. So in this video I'm going to talk about the presentation for content and check out the Leaky News or the Leaky Cauldron write-up. But this is an opportunity to see what it really looks like. It comes in a huge box, it's relatively heavy. And just as on Christmas Day, the opening up experience itself is pretty exciting. You unfold the front flap and you get a sign of Hogwarts. And then once you open this bit up, you find first the Hogwarts logos in here, this folds down, and all the little bits come out. In each of these drawers, and also on the top, you have little booklets like this, Harry Potter Philosopher's Stone, you've got the DVD, the theatrical version, the special features, the Creating the World of Harry Potter disc, and there's a number of discs in this whole collection of that. Table of Secrets and The Prisoner of Azkaban. You also have the label collection, which is a collection of labels used in the Harry Potter films, such as the one for Essence of Dittany, um, and also some brands. And just general, a closer look at the set design, which is just such levels of detail that you want to have a closer look at it. Also, really nicely presented and protected in an envelope is a collection of sketches from the production designer Stuart Craig. It's an extremely high quality reproduction of what were originally very highly detailed sketches and just gives insight into how the production designer saw Hogwarts before it was all created. And again, on this side, you have the Harry Potter DVDs, the Deathly Hallows Part 1 and 2. And then right at the bottom, there's a certificate of authenticity because this is a numbered and limited edition. Um, and then there are some more really gorgeous prints. For example, this one of Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone. That's not it though, there's an exciting secret compartment. Which includes a beautifully presented catalogue of artefacts, showing, for example, props like the Marauders map. Also in here, you have this mysterious canvas package. Opening this up reveals a canvas map of Hogwarts. And this opens up into a layout plan of Hogwarts with marked on different slopes and gradients and where different shots will take place and where different sets will come in. It's similar to the Harry Potter tour in a sense in which it combines things like the canvas map that are an idea of the fictional layout of Hogwarts and things like this which show an insight into the filmmaking and kind of practical layout of Hogwarts and how that layout is achieved. The most special thing about the Wizards collection isn't the special features, it isn't the Blu-ray, it isn't the ultraviolet, it isn't even the fact of having all seven films. It's the presentation and the design and the way you feel when you go and you interact with this product. I think they've done something extremely clever, they've made it an experience. They know that the people buying this won't be casual fans, they're going to be people who really want a really beautiful collection of Harry Potter films because they're already fans. Either that, or this will be bought for people who are wanting to be completely introduced to this series by someone who really cares about them enjoying it, by someone who wants to give them that special experience. The casual DVD fan probably wouldn't like that you have to open everything up to get to a certain DVD. For example, you have to open up both of the little side doors to get to the bottom drawer for Deathly Hallows. But this isn't for the casual DVD fan. This means that even when you're just chilling out with friends and having DVD night and watching some of the Harry Potter films, Opening it up makes this a bigger, more special event. It's the physical extras, the Harry Potter map, the production map, the collections of props and design details that really give people a love of filmmaking as well. In that way, it serves as promotion for the WB Studio Tour and promotes the work of all the filmmakers involved in the Harry Potter series. I was really impressed with it. I'm going to be very sad to box it up and send it back to Warner Brothers after the weekend. And yeah, I really, really want one. Stay close to Leaky News and the-leaky-cordon.org for more updates on the content of the Wizards Collection as I review it. Also, make sure you're following Leaky News on Twitter, twitter.com forward slash Leaky News, Tumblr, leakynews.tumblr.com, Instagram, Leaky News, Facebook, facebook.com forward slash Leaky News, and I think that's it. Thanks very much, everyone. Bye!